Suburban development around military installations can limit training in other military operations. The Army Compatible Use Buffer Program allows installations to acquire conservation easements. James Williams takes us to a farm outside Fort A.P. Hill to see how the program works there. Camden Farm is nestled between the Rappahannock River and Fort A.P. Hill. This 1,300-acre farm has been in the Pratt family for seven generations. In order to keep this working farm in the family, John Pratt decided to partner with the Army and other agencies and allow half his land to become a conservation easement. Pratt cannot sell the land to commercial developers, and his family even has limited rights to future construction. But Pratt says this arrangement is ideal, considering that taxes would have most likely forced his family to sell the land in the future. For me, a lot of, a lot of it comes down to getting paid for something that I wanted to do anyway, which is preserve and protect the property. For Army officials, this easement exemplifies the triple bottom line of Army sustainability. This ACUB effort really allows us to protect our ability to train on AP Hill down the road for many, many decades to come. Uh, it will help preserve uh, precious uh, environmental, uh, natural and cultural resources um, that are here on the property right now. Uh, and then it also really exemplifies the partnership aspect of the community. A community that includes descendants of the Rappahannock tribe. The easement encompasses archaeological remains of the Native American people who settled here hundreds of years ago. It's a win for us. It's a win for us. We get to see the land preserved. The Army takes incredible care of all that they put their hands on, you know, and we get to ride through and enjoy it you know, walk through and enjoy it, and it's preserved for future generations, and I don't think you can really get much better partnership than that. James Williams, Camden Farm in Caroline County, Virginia.